Good morning everyone, my name is Christian from Two-Headed Wolf Gaming and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3 with our East Anglia campaign. If we were to take a quick look on the map, the Byzantine Empire has been slightly split by Bavaria. It's not a huge hit in the state, but it's definitely weakening them, providing us with slightly more options when it comes to alliances and things like that. For the moment, I am going to declare a war on Sweden once again for the ducal conquest of North Reading. So oh, we're just going to spend even more prestige here. It's very unfortunate that it had to happen this way, but what can you do? Uh, we are going to raise our armies once again. We have a bunch of troops that can come into our control pretty soon and, and I'm gonna split this army up. I'm gonna take part of it there and I'm going to walk the rest of the armies here because I do want to take over the war goal. Uh, Ingola Alpine has a claim on this one. What is this territory? Oh, okay, somewhere in the north. Totally fine. Okay, now I'm gonna station some besiegers there, go to the next territory. We're gonna suffer some attrition here and there, but that is totally fine. We're gonna fight this army of raiders here. Nope, they've avoided us. Are they gonna fight us? I think they wanna... No. Okay. So they're raiding these particular lands. Is anything happening here? No, they're still in tribal. I put other people in power hoping... Ah, there you have it. So our Countess actually constructed the castle there. Anything is good right now. Our prisoner here... It's this boy... Let's see. Ransom? Can we ransom you? Oh, we could for a hundred gold, but they don't have the money. We'll take the 44 for now. Because I don't... I'm not sure that the faction will be around anymore. Okay, let's bring them here. Let's see if they're bringing any troops. Nope. Nice, we've taken over that siege. We can go like this. Then the Isle of Man. Can we not call? I would like to call in this war. Our queen is pregnant again. That's really nice. Apparently she's feeling a lot better. Let's see, Ormond. Let's call him in the war. Because I would like him to do the work here. The... The leader of Orkney, so that's why we found out about her claim. Our acquaintance died, it's okay. Increased military presence, garrison size and control growth in the area, that's awesome. For this area. Let's see, what are we doing now? There's no valid type. Every territory we have is at 100% control. It's, it's probably the main reason why we have that huge um, boost in troops, right? Another prisoner has been taken. Ransom. They do not have the money. We'll wait. Uh, yeah, let's return them home actually they're they're trying to besiege our troops here 
If we were to disband all these troops, bring them all together, can I disband you? No. I think we're gonna lose some control here. Yamtland. Yamtland, you've grown strong once again. Maybe it's time to, to break you up a little bit. He's good at diplomacy, he's not great in all areas. Vassals are okay with him. He has a lot of alliances. Probably from all these daughters and sons. Some of which we could actually be taking out. Not the hugest of chances. He is how old? He is now 65, so he won't be alone for long. Let's try to scheme against him. Yeah, this area has been looted, now he's running away. Ransom for 10? Sure. Get all the money we can there. Greetings to the petty king, I accept. Good. Oh, apparently they're not besieging that area. So we're making a whole lot of progresses. Okay, we've been discovered. Let's see, what will he do? Nope. My spy master has come with, to me with grave news. While we do not know who, someone is plotting to kill my guest, Liber. Okay. Um, another prisoner taken in the siege. Nothing special. We were to negotiate re release. Gain with demand conversion, gain with hook. She is not great in anything else. Let's let, let, let her go. Okay, she converted. Monetary administrations. My petty king, I could not help but notice that you might benefit from some monetary aid. My vassal, okay, takes a couple of deep breaths as he proposes an arrangement, a loan to ease the burden on my treasury. Uh, okay, so he gains... Mm, we gain the money, he gains a weak hook, I'll need to use it to repay the loan. I am not that desperate. Well, I'm not, but... For some reason. Another perfect little daughter, Clementia. We are we only have daughters here. Which is a bit unfortunate. And her marriage here is I don't think it's matrilinearly. Okay. Let's see, what else? What else could we do? What else should we do? We have 83 war score, we could go to the Isle of Man. We could even disband this army here. Your culture culture has now discovered fascination bailiffs. A new fa fascination can be selected. So now we can hold probably one more territory as soon as that is done. What else do we want to bring? The Cassus Belli, the Jure Cassus County Cassus Belli. More titles are considered part of a higher title of the Jure. Okay, the holder of such a title has always always has a Cassus Belli to seize control of his de Jure. I think this is what we need. Because for these areas we can't go to war because they're not part of our de Jure. So also let's move our troops here.
I think we can also take this flag, put it here, take a raise all here, meaning the rest of the troops. We're gonna let them here and we're gonna besiege this area. Okay, another available perk as far as diplomacy goes. Force Vassalization Castus Belli. Let's just go for that. We're doing pretty well so far. Everything considered, I think we're in a really good position. A Peasant Revolt here. I don't think they need our help. Sinful Priest exposed, okay. We have the war goal. We're taking over a bunch more territories, sacking them. In the process. Let's see, do they have... They do have a little bit of gold here and there. Um, what else? Neighboring ruler lost war. Oh, it's still the kingdom of Sweden. Okay. Just a tiny bit longer and we can actually... Uh, finish this war against Sweden. The chiefdom of Skane. Hey, let's finish this siege so we can take some extra cash. A scheme at the court, my spy master has come to me with a discovery. He is certain that my vassal, Reeve, is scheming against Luber. Okay, so Reeve. Reeve is the one who offered us money, right? Let the traitor be known to all. We exposed. We expose him. We he spends some prestige. He loses opinion of you. He's exposed in the murder scheme. It is time for him to face the judgment of God. Throw him in jail. And okay, loses opinion, loses opinion. No one will think of me as a tyrant. Okay. Let's throw him in jail. More than that, can I? No, this is an act of tyranny. Ransom? How much does it cost? 30. It is pretty bad, so. He doesn't have a family. He has a few friends. Yeah. Maybe that way we will remove the debt. Good, I took chieftain, the chieftain's daughter there. Can we ransom her now for 10 gold? He will accept, okay. Let's enforce our demands. So be it, we're done there. We can send our troops home. Let's see, how are we on public? Popular opinion of us is at minus nine for offensive wars. So we're just gonna sit still for a little bit and you know, uh, make the people rest and gain a bit more popular opinion. A good deal there. Let's increase control in this area. Let's start converting. Now we're gonna continue converting this place. The petty kingdom of Wessex is... So they're defending against these guys war. Let's see. Or my petty vassal. Can I join your war in any way? Request claim title. Request claim. 
Sway send a gift befriend. Is inherit denounce grant titles revoke title modify. Uh, okay, so we can ask. Uh, these are not our vassals. I don't, I'm not sure exactly what is this war against him. I think he attacked her, right? Yeah. Okay, well, he tried. These are released, siege one. I think we're done here. She's pregnant again. Come on, come on, give us a boy. Uh, please also have our wife educate her. Is any of our other children not... Oh, yes, you. I want her to be great at... Let's see, can we make a good intrigue person? Forest uh, monk? Definitely. So you teach her how to be someone like that. She's rowdy. Our acquaintance Seo Wolf died. How oh, unfortunate, I don't think I have to pay anything back now. Uh, what else, what else? Good, so this area split up into even further territories. Like, he has 7,000 troops, a lot from mercenary. He has a whole lot of gold, or she. Neighborhood war resolved. Educating our kids. We have a bunch of cash. Converting the area is nice, but I think I do want to fabricate as soon as possible some claims here. This is producing a whole lot of gold. I'm relaxing in my castle at the end of the day when my daughter and heir Winifred comes in visibly distressed. Your cousin Countess Burkfred is such a nuisance, she explains. She's always going on and on about how I am unfit to su succeed you. She thinks I'm too impatient to be the petty queen of East Anglia. Are you impatient? Yes. I will help Winifred find a way to respond to the criticism or... I will talk with the Countess, or why bother? Why are you bothering me with this? No, come sit with me, and we shall discuss the matter. We are pretty good diplomats, so hopefully that will work in our favor. I pull Winifred aside for a heart-to-heart -heart talk. I can tell she's frustrated with the situation regarding Countess uh, Burkfred, and I and is willing to hear my advance, my advice. You have more in common than you think. Okay. Uh, they dis resolve their differences. She gains opinion, she gains opinion. Or she loses some opinion and we gain some experience. I could help you practice being patient. So, impatient will provide her. She gains minus two to learning but has prestige. Minus five to opinion of liege, of vassals and so on and so forth. Or she can... Okay, or I will make her pay for criticizing you. And we gain some dread. No, let's make her patient. Let's try to make her patient at least. I sat down and explained that sometimes it is be in the best interest of the realm to be patient. Even if such behavior does not come naturally. She seemed doubtful at first but was encouraged when I told her that such things get easier with time and practice. And now... Nope, she did not gain patient yet. Our cousin was killed in a siege. Your newborn... S yes! With the babe cradled in her arms, petty queen Sierra looks up at me, 
her face surprisingly serene. My love, could we name him Quarantine after my amicable uncle? Quarantine. A lovely idea. Can we gain some opinion? No, actually I had something else in mind. Well, uh, let's see. A good Anglo-Saxon. After an ancestor. Wolfhard? No. Ethelworth? Edmund? Hmm... Wolfnoth? That sounds like a good name. Wolfnoth it is. And now I want to educate you, my son. Yes! Woohoo! Hopefully he will stay alive and power. I am so happy. Bastion and curtain walls constructed in Suffolk. Good. So now we're at least we are we have a bunch of troops. But we are at level 3. I want you... You still take a whole lot of time to, f to convert these areas. Okay, now you're a physician. You have even more learning. Increase control. <sighs> Converting the county is good, but... Let's see, if we check our religion here, I think it's probably best for these areas if I actually start fabricating claims, right? I am thinking that religion will always spread around. So... Yeah, I'm not sure it's the best thing to do it like this, but, you know, let's stay at that. Low county control in North Reading. Okay, we're working on that. We can declare wars. Ten types of wars here. You are in line to inherit. Okay, go on a pilgrimage, call a hunt. Uh, found a new kingdom. I will reun reunite my realm under a new kingdom tile to belong for my dy dynasty for all time. You can create a new kingdom. Every duchy title you hold becomes the jure duchies of your new kingdom. Level of fame. Illustrious. Okay, we are. Independent ruler. We hold three or more duchies. Your realm size is of 30 or more. Gather the realm. At least one of these. So, we can create a title. But it doesn't show us what title. Petty Kingdom and we can create another one. To found a new kingdom. Um, I am not sure. Let's see. What is this? Like a kingdom? No. I'm trying to understand what would be a kingdom. Isn't this a kingdom? Because if so, then if we're creating a new kingdom, I don't think we need one right now. Or the kingdom of Frisia. It's like this kind of title. Kingdom of Pe so this is a petty kingdom and this is a kingdom. Let's let's do it. Gonna cost us most of our money. There you have it, everyone. A realm reforge. I have done what no one else could. I have united the lands of East Anglia with those of Mercia and Greece. 
All my lo life I have worked for this to call my vassals and make them swear fealty anew. Now and forever they will pay homage to me not only as their liege but as king, king of East Anglia. And we have a crown! My realm will last forever. We became the kingdom of East Anglia and this is our primary title. Adopt a special succession type? What is this? So, the too many duchies held. As king and emperor, you can only hold two duchies personally before your vassal starts getting jealous. The more duchies you hold above this, the more envious they will get. You should consider giving away some of your duchies. Okay. You are in line to inherit the titles, powerful vassals, few knights. We can declare a bunch of wars, yeah? You, we can usurp the title of the Duchy of York, okay? And this Principality of Dunabon. Okay. Um, let's see, what is this special succession type? Partition succession makes us weak and divided. Perhaps the realm magnate would accept historically alternative. You may pick a form of tradition elective succession based on your culture or your capitals provided one is available. Elective succession is basically uh, choosing and endorsing someone to take over the land, right? It will be applied to any of your top rank titles using partition succession. Uh, how far are we to going here to primogenitor? You have one or more, if we go with this, Under this, upon succession, all of your late ruler's titles will be given to the player's heir, which is their oldest eligible child. Younger children will receive nothing. We can actually go for this. Now. Or we don't have primogeniture innovation. We go here to culture. So we are at royal prerogative, primogeniture, I guess it's somewhere here. Even in the late medieval. So at this point, going for elective. Elective is not, it's not so bad. I think we are going to do a question of succession. The question of who shall succeed me after my death has plagued me ceaselessly of late. The threat of splitting the realm ever on my mind. Of course, while it is usually difficult to persuade the realm to accept a new order of succession, it can be much easier to return to the old. And we gain 30 opinion for going for Saxon elective. The ruler and all the direct adult de jure vassals of one or, or two ranks below the title can nominate an heir for the most powerful vassal among them. The ruler, legitimate chi child, and any other valid claimant. Yeah, let's go for it. And when we nominate now a successor, we can actually go for our son. Cast a vote on him. Ransom, well, for whom? To the perceptive, he wants us to let her go. Okay, sure. Now let's take a quick look. He's at 19 learning, he's converting the area. We have too many held duchies. The petty king of Huis. So we hold East Anglia, we hold Huis, we hold Mercia, which is quite a, it's, it's a big title and the petty king of Munster. Well, for this one, I'll actually provide it to our as an ambassador. No, marshal, no, nephew, no, spy master. 
Can I not grant it to her? Nope. Can I grant titles to my son? The Earldom of North Reading, I can... Earldom of Lindsay, Earldom of North Reading. I can give to the two of this away. But I guess we are... The problem is not that we're holding small titles, that we're holding kingdom titles. So for the first one, for Moonstar... We need to do a little bit of management here, so please be patient with me. Okay, so the Kingdom of Munster here, we can grant it to one of our guys. Our nephew, Vassal and Knight, he already has a bunch of titles. The Countess of Agatha, Countess Agatha of Connacht, we like her. Let's grant that title to her. And the King We is our We is part Let's see Oxford. Oxford are you part of Mercia or are you part of Fuis? Oxford is part of Fuis. Because I don't really want to give this part of the realm away. No. Are we getting from Stonehenge anything? No. We do not hold Stonehenge as an idea. So we do not get anything out of it. Let's see, and if I would go with the county, the petty kingdom of Fuis and grant them to, to a bunch of people. Your niece and vassal, your marshal, your vassal, your steward. Your son and heir. Yeah, let's also give him this. He has become our vassal. He is also heir, right? Your son, heir and vassal. Yes. Our steward is no more. Let's see, who's the next in line as far as stewardship goes? She has 19 stewardship, but she's a lunatic. Let's work with her. Let's see what's going to happen. Um, oh, she's increasing. Yeah, let's leave her increasing development here. For this particular person. Yeah, let's random them. Let's ransom them for all that. Active election, okay. I accept your ransom, go on a pilgrimage, you can change his contract, I don't wanna. Usurp, you can declare a bunch of wars. At this point, we've done a whole lot of work here. Uh, what is she? Is she... no, she is not a relative or anything I think that's about all the time we have for today I think we've done pretty well in in today's episode we created the kingdom we have a beautiful crown now we're not known as the petty kingdom anymore we're known as the king king's fit helm of East Anglia that is freaking awesome. So I thank you very much for watching and I really look forward to coming back and playing Crusader Kings together with you guys once more. 
If you did enjoy what happened so far, please consider supporting the channel by subscribing if you want to keep in touch, liking the videos in order to help me grow and also comment or send me an email if you have any kind of feedback for me. If not, do not worry about it, just sit back, relax and keep in touch. Bye bye.